Greetings, dear friends in Christ. I welcome you to today's episode of Faith Issues, Wednesday in the first week of Advent, Church's liturgical year B. An Advent period is when we watchfully and prayerfully anticipate the coming of Christ. His coming that will be in history, in mystery, and in majesty. I invite you to reflect with me on the topic, Get Ready for the Banquet of the Lord. In the first reading of today, from the book of prophet Isaiah, chapter 25, from verse 6 to, to 10, we are presented with a picture of banquets being prepared by the Lord. And he said that on this mountain, he's going to prepare a banquet for us, where we shall come and enjoy, eat and drink and make merry, forgetting our problems and our sorrows. And he promised actually to remove our difficulties, our problems, our sorrows, our disappointments. And that happened in the gospel parable. He came to the mountain near the Sea of Galilee, and there he began by healing the sick, the lame, and the mute, and many other people with many forms of difficulties, problems, and sicknesses, including those who are abused, disappointed, betrayed, people in troubled relationship, and various problems of this world. And when he finished that, he then prepared a banquet for them, and with seven loaves of bread and few small fish, he fed 4,000 men. And this is the banquet prepared for us by the Lord. The coming of Christ in his majesty is another big banquet you need to start now to prepare for. Because in 1 Corinthians chapter 2, verse 9, we are told that no eye has seen, no ear has heard what God has prepared for his own people. We need actually to use this particular period of Advent to prepare for this banquet of the Lord. As we are preparing to celebrate on 25th his coming in history, many of us are now renovating our houses, buying material things, things we eat, things we are going to use, things we are going to wear. Let us also remember, let us remember to renovate our spiritual house. We have a tradition of going for Christmas confession. Today is still 6th of December. You can make out time from our time schedules and approach the sacraments of reconciliation and get yourself prepared for this banquet of the Lord. So that when we are celebrating him in history, when he comes in ministry in the Holy Mass, we will also be in the state of grace to celebrate him and to approach him in the sacraments. And this prepares you for the celebration in his coming in majesty. My dear friends, let us make our time to approach this sacrament of reconciliation. If we do not prepare for it, what happened in Matthew chapter 22 verse 12 may happen to us because a man was called out of the banquet hall and he was told, my dear friend, how did you come in here? Because the man was not in his wedding garments. That preparation is important so that we be in state of grace and receive the Lord when he comes as we celebrate him in history, in mystery and in majesty. Thank you for listening to us. I'm Father Cosmas of Nakachukodaya. Peace be with you.